So let's take you through a selection of the best low-key, minimalist, transitional luxury bags to add to your collection. Luxury, low-key, versatile bags that can take you from any day event to an evening soiree and still leave you looking glamorous and elegant. For most of our selection, our transitional luxury bags come with a detachable shoulder strap, a perfect accompaniment that makes the luxury bag a good option to wear during the day. Then simply removing the strap and carrying the luxury bag in hand or as a clutch can take your luxury day bag to a glamorous evening piece. Some of our options work best with having a larger size of the luxury bag during the day and a smaller size of the same luxury bag during the evening. But in most cases, the smaller to medium sizes work best all throughout the day, from the morning to midnight. And at number one, we have the Gucci Diana bag with prices starting at upwards of £2,470 for the mini size in the smooth leather option. The bamboo handle tote bag was first debuted by the Gucci Fashion House in 1991 and was a favourite bag of Princess Diana of Wales, who was a style icon at the time. Over two decades on from her death, Princess Diana still remains an absolute style icon. Princess Diana was credited with bringing the bamboo handle tote bag to popularity. Princess Diana was just as beautiful and elegant in off-duty as leisure wear as she was in her majestic glamour. On many occasions, Princess Diana was pictured rummaging through the bag as she was going about her daily business. The bamboo tote handle bag completed her outfits from sweatshirts to jeans, structured blazers to cycling shorts and summer dresses. The bamboo handle tote bag was paired with everything. The bamboo handle tote bag is said to have become a signature of her personal freedom as she was breaking away from the formality around royal dress codes and her constant use of the bag proved the bag to be a perfect companion for everyday usage. Known to pull elements from the past archives and the house's storied history, Gucci revived the bamboo handle tote bag on July 2021, 20 years on from what would have been Princess Diana's 60th birthday. Alessandra Michele, creative director of Gucci, reimagined the new Gucci Diana bag in her honour and released the updated version of the fabulous bag. Gucci bags with bamboo handles were first released in 1947 as a response to the post-war restriction and shortages, forcing Gucci artisans to think outside of the box and experiment with other materials to reduce the cost of production. The reimagined Gucci Diana bag is a leather bag made with a wooden bamboo handle. And this update comes with a removable, statement-making and interchangeable buckle belt fastener strap enclosing the handles offered in a range of colours like fluorescent yellow, pink and blue. The handle belt straps are an ode to the utilitarian bands that were initially used to maintain the shape of the firm bamboo handles on the original bamboo bags. These buckle belt fastening straps are also sold separately, making this version of the bag distinguishable from the original and bringing a pop of colour. The Gucci Diana tote bag comes in three different sizes, from a mini, small and a medium, and is available in many colours, including the standard black and white and timeless qua colour, which is the closest colour to Diana's own Gucci bamboo tote handle bag, as well as the signature Gucci monogram GG offering. The Gucci Diana bag is also available in precious skins, in patchwork of multicoloured python skin, crocodile skins and ostrich skin. With the Gucci Diana bag, there is an option to add lettering and stars on the leather straps and belt in metallic colours, which can be embossed on the inside of the bag. The Gucci Diana bag also comes with a detachable leather strap, giving the bag multi-purpose carrying options. The Gucci Diana tote bag is a practical and stylish bag and features a roomy square structured silhouette shape and subtle ribs handle detailing. In addition, the bag is adorned with shiny gold hardware with the Gucci double G motif logo on the front. Each belt strap has a functional buckle and features a Gucci script logo in gold metallic film on its outer sides. The Gucci Diana bag has a magnetic stud closure mechanism, 
and opens up to a spacious and luxurious microfiber or leather lined interior and one spacious compartment on the mini and small sizes and two compartments on the larger size with a zip separator pocket dividing the bag. In the front compartment, there is also another zip pocket and an open pocket on the back compartment. The Gucci Diana bag is a bold and sleek design, ideal for daytime or work, adaptable to many lifestyles. From the bamboo detail to the structure silhouette, the Gucci Diana bag imbues all the allure and charm of its namesake. The Diana bag is definitely a timeless style icon, honouring the style icon's legacy and is definitely one to consider for your investment collection. And at number two, we have the Bottega Veneta pouch. With prices starting at upwards of £1,590 for the Mini in the smooth leather option and upwards of £1,780 for the Mini in the Intrachato Weave option. Daniel Lee debuted the Bottega Veneta pouch as one of his first releases as creative director when he joined the Bottega Veneta fashion house in 2018. The pouch is said to pay homage to a classic Bottega moment when Lauren Hutton was clutching a burnt red in Trichato weave clutch under her arm against her Armani trench coat in the 1980s classic film American Gigolo. The bag was later named the Lauren, but Daniel Lee decided to take the star and add his own signature flair. The result of this gave birth to the pouch. The pouch is a soft leather bag that can accentuate and balance any outfit tailored and structured or casual. When Bottega Veneta first released the pouch, it immediately caught the eye of fashionistas globally and is said to be a worthy successor to the Bottega Knot Clutch, a design which date backs to 2001. Instead of the traditional hard shell clutch bags, the pouch was crafted in soft Nappa leather along with its soft gathered pleats and options in the intrachato weave. This staple Bottega Veneta technique offering involves strips of leather that are intertwined to create a woven pattern. The pouch features a solid frame that holds the bag shape with a magnetic closure clasp that makes the pouch appear even more pillowy and soft. The pouch is a simple construction with a somewhat cloud-like shape. It has a delicate and feminine clean-cut appeal and aesthetic. Constructed from a single piece of leather wrapped around the frame, the pouch also exudes the exquisite Italian craftsmanship that Bottega Vianetta is known for. The pouch opens up to a single compartment with a suede lining, blind stamped with the Bottega name and a Made in Italy script. Some options of the pouch come with an accompanying slender shoulder strap for multi-purpose carrying options. As always, Bottega Vianetta uses leathers of the highest quality, which is both supple and durable. Aside from the classic and smooth Napa calfskin and lambskin leathers, it is also available in python skin, leather crochet knit, as well as options in a silver or gold textured leather. In addition, Bottega Veneta has options available in various materials and textures. The pouch is featured in a wide range of colours from primary bold colours to neutrals and neons for both smooth and the intrachato leather options. The pouch comes in a medium or a large capacity size, big enough to hold all your essentials, and the pouch also comes in a mini size. The mini pouch comes with a leather strap that allows the pouch to be transformed into a crossbody or shoulder bag. The Bottega Veneta pouch embodies the Bottega house codes, with its simplicity in design and name, with an essence of innovation and luxuriously timeless appeal. A minimalistic clutch that features no logos, the pouch will have you looking extra glamorous tucked under your arm for any evening occasion. And at number three, we have the Chanel Boy Bag, with prices starting at upwards of £5,060 for the small size. The Chanel Boy Bag was debuted in Chanel's Full Winter collection in 2011 and has fast become an iconic bag of the Chanel fashion house and a mainstay in Chanel's handbag selection that has been offered every season since its release. The Chanel Boy Bag pays homage to the love of Gabrielle Coco Chanel's life, Arthur Boy Capel, who was an English polo player and aristocrat 
in addition to being Coco Chanel's muse and greatest love. Arthur Boy Capel inspired Gabrielle Coco Chanel's tendencies to play with the masculine accent in her style and subsequently inspired the late Karl Lagerfeld. The Chanel boy bag was the first complete redesign of the classic flap. While still honouring many of Coco Chanel's original 255 house codes, the boy bag introduced some more modern updates. The inception of the boy bag started in 2010 when the late Karl Lagerfeld delved into the Chanel archive and came across a bandolier and cartridge bag used for storing ammunition during a hunt. However, Coco Chanel had repurposed the bag for her equestrian trips, using the bag as a purse. Karl Lagerfeld used this as the inspiration for the boy bag and added his signature decadent flair through the use of heavy hardware along with various fabrics and enhancements. Over the years, the Chanel boy bag has been introduced in several sizes, from a mini, small, there was the old medium, the new medium, a large and the XL. With the new medium introduced in 2014, making the boy bag roomier than the old medium and allowing for more organisation of your belongings with two new interior pockets and extra storage space. The medium size tends to be the more popular as you get the best of both worlds, a little more space and convenient enough to carry daily. The Chanel boy bag is available in many versions and variations of leather, materials and hardware. Leathers commonly used are the caviar leather and the lambskin leather. Caviar leather having a textured surface, which makes it a more hardware in leather. And the lambskin leather has a more luxurious look and softer feel. Luxurious textiles used include tweed, canvas, PVC, denim, in addition to special editions like the So Black rendition and the iridescent Chanel Boy Bag offering. The Chanel Boy Bag is also available in a vast and wide array of colours, from block colours to bicolour and tricolour offerings. The Chanel Boy Bag features straight and clean lines with a boxier structure and angular corners and is easily identified by its thick rectangular main body pattern framed by a raised leather ribbon straight edge contrasting the central body of the bag. The Chanel boy bag is usually offered in the classic Chanel diamond quilting, in addition to the chevron quilting on the body of the bag. And there is also the sleek reverso quilting, which consists of an unquilted body and a quilted frame. Another distinguishable characteristic of the Chanel boy bag is its clasp lock closure, bearing the iconic prominent large CC squeeze lock brick lock on the front flap giving the bag a more industrial look. The hardware of the Chanel boy bag appears more antiqued in comparison to the dainty jewellery look of the Chanel classic flap bags and is available in various tones of silver, gold, gunmetal, antiqued and oxidised finishes. But more options are available like in the matte black or the ruthenium offering. The Chanel boy bag also features a shoulder strap composed of thick metal chains, referred to as the bijou chain, due to its wider and heavier links, instead of the signature interwoven straps on other Chanel bags. Some variations of the boy bag are complemented by options of an adjustable short leather strap for comfortability, and other variations come with a short chain top handle so you can also carry it by hand. The Chanel boy bag is a single flap bag, unlike other Chanel bags that open up to a fabric lined interior and a hidden zipper compartment under the top flap. Rumoured to be symbolic of the secret pocket Coco Chanel incorporated into her bag to hide her secret love letters. In addition to the slip pocket on the rear side of the bag, the Chanel boy bag is a highly desired bag amongst fashionistas for its utilitarian feel, more masculine shape, bolder, edgier and versatile design, a departure from the more classic and feminine Chanel handbag styles. The Chanel boy bag strikes the balance between fashion and functionality, the quintessential Parisian accessory, definitely a youthful and timeless piece to consider for your luxury collection. And at number four, we have the Moina Rejane bag with prices starting at upwards of 
£650 for the mini size. The new Rajan design is a tribute to Pauline Moyna herself and the rebirth of the renowned Rajan bag that was first launched in 1903, inspired by and named after her good friend Gabrielle Rajan. Pauline Moyna was the first female trunk maker in history. Not only did she make specially shaped trunks to fit the contours of automobiles, she was also the first trunk maker to produce women's handbags. Pauline Moyna created the Rajan bag in Gabrielle's honour, and it was one of the first bags to pay homage to a celebrity still available today. Rajan was a belle époque actress and a woman of character, allure and charm. Ramesh Nair is today credited with inventing the new Rajan bag. The latest Rajan shapes and designs are praised for its brilliant craftsmanship, reinvented as a structured city bag with a patented locking system. The Rajan perfectly blends its structured boxy silhouette with sensual clean lines and feminine curves, reminiscent of the delicate curves of Monash trunks of the past. It also features an iconic clasp. The lock clasp mechanism fastener is like a little jewel-like seal, delicate and feminine, similar to one of the first fasteners patented by Monash, featured on its very first bag suitcases. The rounded bijou closure is a re-addition of a patented lock mechanism model of the Art Deco period. Nayer reworked it, turning the clasp upside down, reinventing the Rajan with a piece of Moinas own history. The Rajan also features an accompanying and adjustable strap that makes the Rajan a versatile bag. The Rajan is available in a variety of fabrics and leather options, including Tourillon Jex, a hardy pebbled leather, box leather, a lustrous, shiny and smooth leather, carrot calf, similar to the Tyrolean Jex, but with a much finer grain, the natural calf like the box leather, but less shiny, in addition to a range of natural and exotic precious skins like crocodile. The Moina Rejan bag is available in a vast array of block colours, in addition to bicoloured and tricolour combinations seasonally. The Moinari Jean bag is a regal looking bag radiating grace, elegance and excellence, crafted with care and precision and handled with such grace by a single artisan from start to finish. The Moinari Jean bag opens up to a roomy interior with a wide base and interior zip pocket and also comes with a clochette. The Rejan is also finished with shiny hardware elements, including the clasp and protective feet all round. The Rajan is available in a range of sizes, including the Nano, the BB Mini, the PM and the Rajan MM regular model. In addition to the recently added size 23, measured by the Bates width, that sits in between the BB and the PM size. The Rajan 23 also has a variation known as the Rajan Duet which gives a pop of colour contrast in unexpected places on the Rajan bag. Under the handle, the base of the bag, upside of the flap or over the straps. With the Rajan bag, Moina has managed to seamlessly combine innovative techniques with their take on old world craftsmanship. The Moina Rajan bag embodies Moina's exceptional savoir-faire and luxury synonymous with Moina. An excellently crafted, timeless bag to add to your wardrobe. And at number five, we have the Saint Luan Sac de Jour bag with prices starting at upwards of £1,720 for the nano size. The Sac de Jour was debuted under creative director E.D. Suleimani in the Fall Winter 2014 collection. Seen on the arms of socialites and celebrities alike, the Sac de Jour bag fast became an it bag due to its practical nature and its minimal yet stylish look. The name Sac de Jour translates into bag of the day and is the perfect everyday handbag. It is a signature handbag for the Saint Laurent fashion house and remains one of the most coveted and iconic styles. The Sac de Jour bag features a sturdy structured rectangular shape with double roll topped handles in addition to gusset accordion like sides fixed by threaded straps and snap buttons, 
which are also expandable in order to create more room in the compact but very well organized interior. The sac de jour also features a leather tag with a padlock feature. The sac de jour is a simple and understated bag that opens up to a nice contrasting suede lining, which adds to the luxurious aesthetic and is divided into three compartments by a large zip closed compartment that runs down the middle of the bag in addition to the troves of useful pockets and zipper compartments. The sac de jour bag also has several pieces of metal hardware detailing including metal studs on the base for added protection, the snap closure, locks and zipper pulls that contain the Saint Laurent logo, offered in a gold or silver tone hardware. The sac de jour is available in four different sizes, the nano, the baby, the small and the medium. The sac de jour is a simple, sleek and sophisticated bag that can easily transform you from a day to evening event, no matter the occasion. The nano size is perfect for fashionistas that don't have much to carry. The baby size is also big enough to carry you through to the evening with a little extra space. The small sac de jour is the ideal everyday bag and perfect accessory for busy women on the go and suitable for professional work environments as well as casual outings. The medium is the largest with an extremely roomy interior that fits everything inside, also perfect for work and travel. The sac de jour bag is commonly crafted from premium 100% calfskin leather or other materials and some options come in a unique finish. The sac de jour is offered in textured leather, grained and pebbled, which is a bit more scratch resistant, and options in smooth leather, soft and buttery leather, and also a crock embossed finish. The additions to offerings in suede with a smooth leather lining and top handles. The sac de jour bag also features multi-purpose carrying options whereby you can switch between either the top handles or the optional detachable flat shoulder strap. The Saint Laurent Sac de Jour bag is a truly elegant and minimalistic bag that does not boast ostentatious labeling, but just a discreet Saint Laurent Paris logo printed in gold foil stamp on the main compartment under the handles. The Saint Laurent Sac de Jour is available in a variety of colors whether in the traditional black or navy blue, grey, burgundy or beige. The sac de jour bag is an edgy, stylish, contemporary and effortlessly cool and is undoubtedly a timeless shape, a seasonless choice and a true classic. And at number six we have the Fendi Peekaboo bag with prices starting at upwards of £3,400 for the mini Peekaboo in the smooth leather option and upwards of £3,120 for the Peekaboo I See You Petite size. The Fendi Peekaboo bag debuted on the runway for the Spring Summer 2009 collection and was created by Sylvia Venturini Fendi, the granddaughter of Adele and Eduardo Fendi, who is credited with designing and launching one of Fendi's most timeless and iconic bags. The Fendi Peekaboo bag was envisioned as a timeless heirloom, a classic that can be passed on to the next generation. Fendi has imagined and revitalized the Fendi Peekaboo season after season, solidifying its appeal to women from all generations. Famed for its iconic design, the Peekaboo bag takes its name from the popular children's game Hide and Seek, and also gets its name from its unusual construction, where the two internal compartment halves are divided in the middle by a rigid partition by a metal bar. This creates a front flap that can be pushed down to reveal the central partition and the artistry of the bag inside. This gives the peekaboo an element of surprise as it gives you a peek, revealing the interior with the engraved Fendi logo plate. The Fendi peekaboo is a sleek, classic and timeless design. The peekaboo is crafted from a smooth or grained calfskin leather and opens up to a napper leather lined interior with two big spacious compartments, an inner zippered pocket and elements of gold hardware, including the twist lock on the front and the back of the bag to keep it securely fastened, in addition to the metal stud feet to protect the base. The Fendi Peekaboo bag is a versatile bag that features a single top handle and an adjustable detachable shoulder strap in the micro and mini size, which means it can be either carried by hand or worn over the shoulder or as a crossbody. The Fendi Peekaboo has been released in various fabrics, leathers and materials, from supple veal skin to snake skin and raffia suede corduroy leather and canvas. From sophisticated black patent leathers to the classic red and blue ones, the Fendi Peekaboo is available in more than 1,000 materials and an unlimited colour palette. 
The popularity of the Fendi Peekaboo bag has produced a foray of sizes, from the large to the regular to the mini and the micro. The micro is the smallest size suitable for all your essentials on a night out. The mini and the regular are ideal as everyday bags. The large size is the biggest and perfect for any busy woman on the go, ideal for any professional work settings and all your everyday work items. The Fendi Peekaboo also consists of a collection, including the Fendi Peekaboo Celeria, a simple and structured version of the Peekaboo. Also available is the higher end Peekaboo Essential and the Peekaboo Essentially, a smaller sized essential. Lastly, there is the Peekaboo I See You bag, also a spin off that is inspired by the children's game Peekaboo I See You. One of the most distinctive features of the Peekaboo I See You are the customizable interior pockets, which are also removable and interchangeable into smooth leathers or precious skin. The Peekaboo I See You bag is a fresh take on the iconic Peekaboo and is the most playful yet perfect for fashionistas looking for a more personalised option. Available in three sizes, including the medium, east, west and the pochette. The Peekaboo is a simple, complex and timeless bag. The appeal lies in its understated sophistication and elegance, with a discreet if you know you know appeal, as it's not loud or embossed with any logos. The Peekaboo is a testament to the bag's timeless look, and Fendi's quality craftsmanship has proven to stand the test of time. And at number six, we have the Louis Vuitton Alma bag in the Epi leather, with prices starting at upwards of £1,400 in the BB size. Created in 1934 by Gaston Louis Vuitton, the Louis Vuitton Alma bag was actually rumoured to be a custom-made bag at the request of Gabrielle Chanel. But it wasn't until years later that Coco Chanel gave her permission to manufacture the bag for general consumption of all fashionistas. The Alma is a practical and compact trapezoidal bag with a long base evolved from the Louis Vuitton streamer bag. Although the Alma is now one of the most recognisable handbags in the world, it has taken several decades for this model to evolve. It was first redesigned in 1950s and called the name Sac Marceau. It was then redesigned to be more compact and modernised for everyday use and renamed the Squire bag. An additional year, few years later, it was renamed the Sac Champ Elise. Yet again, the bag model reappeared in 1992 with an updated and revitalised design and slimmer profile. Decked out in Louis Vuitton's signature monogram canvas and given, name, given the name Alma, a tribute to Place the Alma, a landmark spot in the tree lined square in Paris where the Avenue Montaigne meets the Seine in the Paris high fashion district. The Alma bag is a capacious and functional bag with a wide opening. The Alma bag opens up to an interior lined with microfiber with two inside compartments. The Alma also features many elements of gold hardware, including the sturdy studs at the bottom of the bag and zippers. Since 1992, the Alma has appeared in different finishes, fabrics and colours, adding to the appeal of the Alma. A sleek and chic bag, sophisticated enough to elevate any outfit. The Alma is offered in a variety of colours, prints, graphics and limited edition designs too. The Alma is available in different materials from the classic monogram canvas to the monogram venice and epi leather. The Alma is available in five sizes that suit and serve different purposes in different fashionistas. The Alma comes in sizes from the Nano, BB, PM, MM and GM. The BB meaning ban Beba Bandelier, which is French for baby shoulder. The BB version has a detachable shoulder strap, which means fashionistas now have a bag with even more utility and versatility. The PM size stands for petite model in French, meaning small model. The MM stands for median model, moyenne model. The size along with the PM are the most popular size. The grand model, the GM size, is the largest size, a popular size for travel. The Alma is a lovely, sophisticated bag that is timeless and classic.